Morning boys and girls. Woke up rather chilly today. Don't know why. I don't know what's happened. Do you think it's something to do with that Storm Franklin? Well, I wonder what storm's coming next. They're in alphabetical order. So long as it ain't Storm Gary, you'll be fine. Because if it is, you better watch out. <laughs> I will huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. More like one of the three pigs. That's me. Well, we tried the Harry Ramson's uh, chips yesterday uh, with some Iceland fish and sort of some sort of batter. Absolutely beautiful. Even though the good lady of the house made me too many chips. I have mushy peas and some Cajun onion rings. Not bad. At lunchtime, we had uh, meat feast pizza from Tesco with barbecue sauce. Not my liking. Not enough cheese. Barbecue sauce was salty, as well as being very rich. And I'm not a, as you know, that sort of person type of food. So I just made do with um, what I had. On other news, though, uh, Tracy emailed the wheelchair company like she said she would. And hopefully... Within the next seven days, I shall have a shiny new wheelchair next to me, which will be very nice. And uh, for mobility, my application for my Ford Custom Transit van, that's gone through. Got to keep in contact with GM Coachworks now down at Newton Abbott because they're the people who are building it and ordering it from, um, I think it was... Uh, not Torquay. Why did I want to say Torquay? It's from um, Tunisia or somewhere. Turkey. Huh? Yeah, they're in you now, but where's it being built? No, my car. Oh, Turkey or Spain? Turkey. in Turkey. Turkey, Torquay. Sounds the same, doesn't it? Especially when you've had a few beers. Do you know I might buy a lampshade for that? Because that's rather bright, isn't it? So I can sit there like that all day and go, Oh, look, there's your finger. It's still poorly. But no, I just persevere. <clears throat> I had uh, Emily out yesterday. She's a bit worried about the uh, deterioration of the area surrounding my sacrum wound. Uh, so she's going to speak to the lead nurse, Abigail, to try and see if they can find something different or alternate days yeah, of uh, changing it. I still blame the tape on the biotane, but there you go. Then I had Sarah and lovely Jojo, the one who made me my absolutely superb bit of bread pudding. Well, bit. That's going to last me at least a week. At least. And that's just having a little nibble. Great big round thing, the size of a sweet tub it is. Oh, and she said she made too much. She had a bit left over. A bit? Ooh, ho, ho. you keep making them like that, girl. You and me are getting on like a house on fire. And what else did I have through the post? Old terms and conditions from Utilita, my electric company, telling me about what's going to be happening and what's not going to be happening. Uh, I can read their rules the charter book and the prices and all that kerfuffle. Not that I really want to. Um, oh, uh, from the loan I had out a few years back, um, they've agreed to a repayment plan. So I got that through, a certificate, telling me my last payment will be in 2050 at £5.35. Up until then... 10 quid a month. Yeah. It was uh, three grand, I think, I owe. And then, obviously, they sent me the direct debit as well, so I could see what I'd said and, you know, what I'd agreed to. So, say hello this morning. Hello. Come on, Mr. Terry. Uh, hold on, Terry. Mr. Terry wants to see your face on the video. You must smile for him. Hello. No, come on, real smiles. Hello. Isn't she a pretty girl, eh? Very special. 
Oh no, don't. I haven't done my hair yet or my makeup. I still look a bit like, what's her name? The uh, JT, the Collins woman. What's her, what's her first name? The Collins woman. Joan Collins. Not Joan Collins. Well, you could be. Jackie Collins. Not Jackie Collins. TC, JC. The real JC, the real something C. Gemma. GC, that was it. Oh, you do. A <laughs> big fat and brilliant. But there you go. Don't tell anyone I said that. She might come and smack me. I don't mean my wife. The button's gone. Uh, today is just a boring day, I think. Tracy's out this evening to the gear shop. Then she's, uh, I don't know what we're having for tea because fish and chips, fish and chips we normally get. I'd say we had our homemade ones to save a bit of money. So it might be a Chinese again. I don't know. Uh, still got one pizza left. Uh, some dirty fries. Uh, we got. Trying to think. Oh, steak and kidney puddings. We've got steak and kidney puddings. Seven minutes in the microwave. No, it's not. It's 90 seconds in the microwave. <laughs> Seven minutes, there'd be nothing left of them, would they? I don't know. But anyway, while she's clattering her around in the kitchen, I'm going to go and get ready. I've got an appointment with a hairdresser. Do you reckon I need it cut? No? But <laughs> I'll talk to you tomorrow anyway, all right? Don't forget, for your chance to win one of our exclusive Gary's Daily Blog hoodies, just send me your name and your address, obviously, uh, in a private message or email gdavison541 at hotmail.co.uk. As soon as we get to 20, at least 20, 20 is all I want, entries, Tracy's going to draw a winner, all right? All right, I'll speak to you tomorrow. Love you lots. Ta-ra.